They actually, they actually updating the game. They had a wreck mod. I want to make a know. video to talk about season three updates and the current state of RH right now. I know a lot of people have been asking and wondering like what's going on with the new update uh, that consists of wreck and the journey pass instead of like writing a paragraph or two and posting it in Discord. I feel like this way the message will spread more and people will know what's going on. So first thing I want to talk about the roadmap that we released like May 9th. When we made the roadmap, everything that we had put there was like, we had everything set up in a way where we'd be able to uh, import those game modes. But like when the game released, we had a lot of like issues to work with, like a lot of bugs and different things. We were still working on season three, but just not as much. But we decided to like hold off on a bit. That way when season three does come with Rec, we have less bugs and just overall just a more playable game. That was really the goal with it. So we de we delayed yeah. season three and delayed um, Rec Center because we wanted them both to release at the same time providing like a lot of people a lot of more content in the game. That's why things kind of got delayed on the roadmap and things got changed around. We do have to make a new roadmap to release because we do have kind of like an idea of the direction we want to go now with how we do our updates now and everything else. But as of right now, we're just kind of working well. on everything. So for the development timeline, I kind of want to talk about like when we really started working on season three because there's a lot of like confusion going on. And even when we started working on beta of this game, the development on RE2, like the current RE2 right now that we see and that we're able to play, it started around like 2022 August and we released in May 9th of 2023. Rec Center was supposed to start development like around the same time we released, but we actually started it. Must have inspired GG's beforehand before we even released because we kind of wanted it to go with the release so we was already I got you bro don't worry i'll give you a sub bro you got snowy you got you right now yeah. how do i give subs never mind i don't know how to do this um uh never mind never mind never mind I don't know. I'm, I'm not, I'm not. It's cool. Someone gonna get feeling it. concepts Probably. and Hopefully. ideas for the rec center, but it just never made it to the actual. I'm gonna all over your okay. because we were kind of busy with other things, like and other the features we wanted to get in before the actual release. So that's why rec never came. A lot Dude, of people I'm were asking like, how I'm come not. Alpha had pro am, but Beta doesn't have pro am. We just only have Park instead of the pro am, and that's kind of like the answer to it because like we thought like it would be better just have it. At and all that like i think it was october or maybe september around that time we already had like kind of the basics of rec going and i was developing it on streams and stuff now which i still do from time to time i kind of stopped uh, streaming development on the rec because it's mostly done for the it's, it's mostly done there is a couple of things so it's that fucking done it, but that's just more like personal things that i want to change more of just okay. like yes, UI sir. things and like how designs awesome or at the rec and even with sound effects like i'm just kind of polishing it up but rec is mostly done when it comes to developing season three content gonna release in a month. we yeah. sometimes might jump around but for the most part we stay in order with everything and just finishing it up and i'm glad we finished it up because we were able to move on to like different features that we have planned for y'all including the ball trails that was sneak peek as well as some of the mascots and a lot of people wonder why we started developing the the whole season three content in October compared to compared to when we said we start on the roadmap. It's because a lot of the bugs and we wanted to make sure the game was very playable before we start adding on to the game. For season three, we actually have like a lot of content planned out for everyone. I'm not really able to talk about all the stuff that we have, but I am able to just speak on a couple, yeah, a couple funny things. Guy that we've already showed it. So one of the things Oh my god, we're gonna get that, oh uh, wait, beat. hold on. Oh we get stats boosts and shit. Bro, Bitman's gonna be so OP. Do they got Bitman's like slashing boost and shit? Talk about all the yo, Koda, like, yo I am able to just speak Stop what you doing? Okay. Uh the fuck? What, 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 what's going on? Ha! <laughs> what's going on? Wait, what happened? 
Stop what you're doing, Ice Spice Drop. Nigga, we already fucking seen that shit. We already seen it, boy. We already seen that shit when we started streaming. You ain't think I knew that? Come on, now. We already seen that ass, bro. Come on, bro. We been seeing that, man. It's been an hour. A couple we already seen it, nigga. That we already showed. It. So one we of the things was mascots that uh, we sneak peeked. Yeah, so mascots are going to be in season three, and they are going to be Ooh. obtainable, and you're going to be able to wear them. So that's just one of the things that's coming to season three. Uh, we have ball trails now, different ball trails. You can choose between different types of ball trails. Like uh, I don't want to name all the ones we have currently. Is it have fire? That we have Ooh. the fire one and we have a bunch more that's being made on the season three journey pass there's going to be um way more way more rewards compared to the season two journey pass on season three journey pass we're going to have way more stuff added uh compared to what you see here on the season two yeah it really wasn't shit for the uh, awards for season three it wasn't really like that much it wasn't really that much on journey that pass. uh it's going to be way more slots filled so hopefully it encourages people more to grind out their journey pass and actually look forward I gotta to that. Fulfill we do my have Rhett coming in season three as well. Oh yeah, new build time. Grind new build time, chat, new build. What the fuck kind of late? Whoa, what the fuck was that? Man, what was this? What is that? What, what move is that? Man, what the fuck? We also plan to have league mode in season three. Ma'am? Yes, ma'am. Yeah, back, y'all. Song reaction? Uh, later, later, later. Remind me. Season three, but an update. Our players were experiencing. We still have their own. We do plan to give y'all next roadmap. We also plan to drop updates more consistently instead of with season three. We we wanted to like hold everything and just like add like a bunch of features in one. So like see, with season three, you're not just getting wrecked. You're getting the new journey pass, a couple more gameplay additions, uh, a lot of more, a lot more content, and you get like a lot more stuff that I can't really talk about. But okay. with future updates, I kind of want to just do like one thing at a time. So if I'm adding a game mode in the future, it will just be that game mode alone. And if I'm adding like new content, it'll be that new content alone. It won't be. That's fire, bro. I ain't, I don't, I ain't think they were gonna update that shit. I thought it was gonna be like no updates, but shit, bro. That's fire, man. Finally, some updates, man. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. But I understand, though. I understand what they were saying, though. I understand. They they had to uh, fix bugs and stuff. Uh, 